What's up, guys? I'm Crazy Egg. Welcome back to Illusor, the Rune Slayer series. I'm scared. I don't want to do this, but we're going to do it anyway. All right. I think you guys know what it's all about. Let's go ahead and just get started. Menthu is joining us again. Yeah, Menthu. Way to be a trooper. So, unlike usual, when I usually do these on very hard, I'm going to do this on normal. And there's a reason for this. There's a reason for this that you will see. But we're going to do this on normal. Okay, so that's catch number one to this episode. There will be more catches later on. I assure you, there's many twists and turns. But uh, we're going to start with that one. And you will see why. I guarantee it. It will be very clear why I chose to do that. But anyway, this dungeon, you, I know you, you're, I have words for you, or I don't, you know, whichever, however you want to look at it. But um, this dungeon is Come, fight me. very interesting. I love how this dungeon looks, by the way. It is so cool. It's like this giant astronomical observatory. There's catch number one. Everyone noticed Menthu fell off there. There's catch number one. So, all right, okay, my headphones are way too loud. Oh, geez, and I'm already dying profusely. I am profusely dying. Boink, yay, buffed enemies. Buffed mobs in Elysion, yeah, great, awesome. Also, you'll notice I'm still level 85, but I have 14 resurrection stones this time, so that's good. Also, I don't really want that awakening potion, but whatever. All right, go up and get this. Eh. Menthu, come, Menthu. Okay, fine, you can fight stuff. Oh, no, no, don't fall off. Okay, there are blueberry. That will, that will marginally help. I'm gonna do this and get the buff out of it, but um, I really do like how this dungeon looks. This dungeon looks really cool. And the first time I came here, I was like, no. The first time I came here, I was like, wow, everything looks so cool. Also, that is a buffed shield mob. This game just hates me. My God. <laughs> Ow. You'd think you couldn't get any worse than the shield mobs that are already here. But no, now they're buffed as well. Oh, he's, uh, is he doing the thing? I think he was gonna do the thing, but I think we knocked him out of it, maybe. Yay, yay, he died and we didn't. That's good. But yeah, I really like how this dungeon looks. I mean, look how fast and cool it is and all the moving parts and stuff. It's really cool. It's like being inside a giant telescope. I like it, it's really cool. However, there are things I don't like so much, like these things. Literally platforms that just come and go that you have to eh, That you have to make it across before they disappear cuz that's what I want Now I'm gonna try to not complain too much about this dungeon But let me just tell you I'm not oh come on stupid. Okay. I'm not a huge fan of all the traps and stuff I think they're a cool idea. I think it's a really cool idea to have traps and stuff It's just that I find that the traps that they chose are just so irksome then I don't like them like that I don't like platforms just disappearing for no reason <laughs> and they just require patience I know I get that but I'm not a patient man <laughs> okay really we're oh god taking so much damage taking so much damage and trying to balance my auras at least it means I'm looking at my health bar a lot come on give me a roasted mutton oh it's not a roasted mutton you Dick. Eh. Whatever. Also, why is that platform back there there? I knew you weren't dead. Actually, I didn't know you weren't dead, but I like to think you weren't dead. Okay. I should have awakened before that, but whatever. I'm going to do that and then heal because this guy has... Yeah, he has... Remember when we fought him and he basically killed us with every single move? That's basically what he does now, except this time, he doesn't telegraph anything. There's no messages to tell you, so you actually have to watch him, and... I thought he was gonna do something. That... Nope, now he's gonna do something. Dang it. I should've mana broke. I did not mana break. I was dumb. I saw it coming. Should've mana broke. Did not. Mana breaked? I think I decided it was gonna be mana breaked. Okay, so... Yeah, so this guy is actually kinda tough now because he doesn't... Nope. Ah, okay. Because he doesn't actually telegraph anything, so... There we go. Got him. Good enough. One death. I was hoping for zero. Because I was kind of hoping to have all the resurrection stones for the boss, but whatever. Down to 13 now. Down we go. That's so cool. Actually, not down we go. Up that thing goes. We're not moving down. Oh, but it just, it looks so cool. It looks so cool. But now, oh no. Oh no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Uh, go. 
And then quickly, no! Oh, I hate these things so much. So if you if you jump up into those, those it hurts. See, just like that. I had to de I had to demonstrate the direction. I did not intend to actually jump into them though. Okay, I'm gonna go down and do that. But man, like those things are just like here. Do you want to jump? You know, just like in this perfect. No. Okay, really? Get. Ugh. Can I hit him? Yes, I did. Okay. Watch out, Menthu. And those guys explode. And we all know my history with the Lagoos and Is Witches. I have no desire to be near anything that explodes. And then there's these cute little things that are really annoying cute little things that will put you to sleep and stuff. No. Wait, these aren't the ones that put you to sleep. But these are still really annoying. We'll get to the ones that put you to sleep in a second. There we go. There's one's going to put you to sleep. The Shing Pangs. Those are the ones that put you to sleep. Those little orbs, if they touch me, they'll put me to sleep. Which is really annoying. I shouldn't have picked that up, but whatever. Okay. 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 Menthu took care of most of this, but we'll help him and finish it off here. No, 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 no. I got this, Menthu. You, you can go up ahead if you want. I got this. I got this. Don't worry. Don't you worry. Da, da, da. There we go. Because, yeah, those guys. Oh, the traps. Oh, more traps. Oh, more traps. Ah. Oh, God. And that one's timed. You have to make it there before the time runs out. Or else you start losing health because it's the end of the, the floor. Man. But yeah, the guys that put you to sleep are just... Ugh. Okay. No, no, no. I see your stupid little orbs there. Man, I just... Being put to sleep is like the most frustrating thing. Because it's only for a sec... Okay. It's only for a second. But if they catch you, they can catch you again. And again. And again. Oh, I'm asleep again. Ugh. <laughs> oh. No, 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 I see you, orbs. Okay, Menthu, is okay. That's good. Eh. Okay, no. See, how do you get up close to him without repeatedly being put to sleep? No, no, no more. You're done. You're, no, stop. Stop, please. Oh, there's another one back there. This is the problem. Ah. <sighs> Thank you, Menthu. That one's all on you. I'll take care of this one down here. Oh, man, I tell you. It's kind of a cool idea to have, because like a lot of the dungeons are repetitive, and Elsewhere gets kind of a lot of flack for having repetitive dungeons. I get that. That's fair enough. But here's the thing. Oh no, no, the harpoon's behind me. Oh god. But being put to sleep and being shot with harpoons and lasers is not my idea of a good time. Okay, I gotta go up there and get him. Go, go. Eh, no, you, you, sir. You, sir, are going... Okay, no. Let's not... No, no, no. No more sleep orbs, please. None. Just no none. Oh, crap. Crap. Can I... Okay, yes. You fall down, too. That works for me. Okay, he's dead. All right. Now I gotta... Oh, I guess Menthu got a different thingy than I did. Ah, oh, crap. Man. That one I shouldn't have missed. That was just me failing to jump. Okay. There we go. That's how you jump, kids. You do it with your feet. Yeah. And the rest of your legs. And also that one's time too, so that can get really annoying. But yeah. Uh, this is a straight down, right? Yeah. And then, oh yeah, lasers. Yeah, because because those are good. Eh. And then awaken. And then thingy. I'm going to heal again, perhaps against better judgment. No, no, no. Let me up. Let me up. Let me up. Let me up. Get out of my way. Okay. Okay, you. And also these lasers don't really knock you back or anything. They just damage you while you're in them. So... Don't go in them because they won't knock you down or super armor you or anything. You just get to take all the hits. It's fun. It's a great time. Okay, I'm gonna do that and then move because you're about to explode. Okay. Oh, no, no. Wait, wait. Be patient. This dungeon is all about patience. Thank you, Menthu. Appreciate it. Oh, man. And then this cool looking room. It's pretty. It's like an observatory. I think it actually is an observatory, basically. Adrian Nesad was your father. Kind of. Alright. Now, here is where I really like having my deadly chaser, because I just sit at the side and do heavy railgun and just kick the crap out of all these guys. It's super easy, super not stressful. But not with my Rune Slayer. Oh no, and then he does this. Yeah, he does lasers across the bottom. Because there weren't enough lasers already. Oh, I was hoping that would hit the Shing Pang, but it did not. Oh, come on. No, do the move. Come on, do the move. There you go. That's how you do it. Okay, now awaken. Or not. Oh, I got I got my awakening cancelled. That's good. That's good. No, nah, that's my favorite. I like that. Okay, uh... No, come on. No, that's not what I wanted to do. This is what I wanted to do. Thank you. Thank you. No, get out of the laser. I don't like lasers, guys. I don't. 
but it's whatever. I can deal with them, maybe. I like I tell myself I can deal with them. That's how I sleep at night. But um I reality is I probably can't deal with them. Purbon, which is actually spelled with an O, not with a, oh god. No, no, no. Okay, let's start with that, and then let's not die here. Okay, so we're on normal, and this is why I chose normal, because there's this phase of this fight in which you have to hit Purbon. Purbon. No, no, get out of the, okay, well, I'm in the lasers. Get out of there, crap. And then those things will explode after a certain amount of time, but just don't go near them and, and you're fine. But yeah, there's a certain phase of this fight where you have to kind of knock him around a little bit to prevent him from going invincible for a short period of time. Right, right now. So, what, doing this in, okay, I don't think we made it. I don't think we made it. Yeah, we didn't make it. Okay, so, ah, crap. And this is where we die a lot. But I'm just gonna wait until the lasers stop before I resurrect. So, in very hard, we were not able to ever get him, we were level 85 when we were doing it, but we were never able to get him to actually get knocked. Compared to at normal, it, it was much easier. Now, those were still with our mains and not with these characters. Oh, come on. But, um, but we were still able to actually do it. It was possible to do it at level 85. So that's why I chose normal, because this fight will just be way, way, way less painful, way less deaths if, if we do it on normal. So that's the whole spiel behind normal. And now let's actually put that knowledge to good use. Okay, I should be using, hang on. I have a thing I should be using. Okay, first I'm gonna use that, and then get down here. I'm gonna use that on you. And hopefully that will make damaging him a little easier. Nope, don't shoot me. Okay, well you shot me anyway. Fine, whatever. Okay, awaken. Uh-oh, do that! Yay, yay iframes. I don't even think I hit him with wind blade, but I don't care, it was free iframes. Go, 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 go. Okay, so if I can, no, don't do the, don't do the laser so soon. Hey, we did knock him. Actually, I think Menthu knocked him, but whatever, I'll take it. Come on, healing thingy, thank you. Okay, go, boom, and look at all that super armor he's give, given off. He's just a super armor pro. No, ah, lasers, I do not like lasers. Thank you, thank you, Menthu. I thought I think that was more for his benefit than mine, but whatever. Here we go. I don't know how long those things last, so I'm trying to use them a little liberally, just so we're never actually running out. No, move. Move my butt! Ah! I'm stuck in the vortex of doom! Stupid vortex of doom! Me no likey you! Okay, I have... I have... Dang, I should've done that. I have the full vi... Or not vitality, I have full destruction, so... Come on, knock him! No! Do iframes! Thank you! And go! I don't know, yeah, he did get his invincible state. Crap. Oh no, 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 no. I'm probably gonna die again, yeah. You can't duck in this game, okay? It was like coming from my head, and I'm like, I see you, but I can't do anything about you. And he stopped. Okay. I like how he just dodged Menthu's wild charge there. He's like, yeah, I'm gonna just teleport over here. No, nope, get over it. And do that. Because it'll give me a little bit of a buff. And do that again. And do that. Oh, crap. Okay. I need to get in there and... Oh, or not. No, this is not where I want to be. Not a happy place. Ow. So not necessary, dude. It's not like I dislike you. Oh, come on. Okay, I think I hit him. I I must say that was my kill because at the very least I had the chutzpah for it. It was great. Okay, so Mentu and I are gonna go to the Gates of Darkness to chill off after this, but uh, yeah, that was fun. That was less that was less stressful than last time, but man, that was still more death than I intended. I do kind of like the dungeon. I just hate getting caught in the traps and I, I the boss is very much challenged. Hey, I did lots of damage. Yeah! Sweet! Anyway, so that's all I got for this episode, so thank you so much for watching, and until next time, I'll see you later. Kill him. Make, it, make an example of him. Ow, it hurt me. I've been hit by fire. I didn't even take my health away. It's just, you've been hit by fire. Uh, you're being all crazy-like, so I'm gonna go this way. Toodles, noodles. Boink. Bye. See ya.